Hello happy people, I'm back with another video and today I'm bringing you all a highly requested video. Um, I have been asked to do this video from a few subscribers and I'm happy to finally get around to filming it. So it is my top complimented uh, Bath and Body Works since. And so um, I am going to go down the list. Um, I think I compiled about five scents here that I always get compliments on anytime I wear them. I'm super excited about this video. Um, like I said, it was highly requested and let me hop right on into the scents. So starting off first, this is a retired scent. It's an oldie but a goodie and it is Sensual Amber. Um, this is what the packaging looks like here. Um, yeah, I think this is the really, this is the older packaging, but this is a really great scent. The scent notes on this is golden amber, wild berries, orange flower, lotus petals, and creamy sandalwood. So let me go ahead and miss this really quick and see. Oh, uh, yeah, this scent is really, really good. This is like a grown and sexy scent and this is something where anytime I wear it people always compliment me on it it's grown and sexy it's sophisticated you can really smell that that amber come out of it it's, it smells like a golden warm amber um I didn't know that this scent actually had berries in it so there is a hint of like slight fruitiness but it really is just like amber like hardcore amber and it has, like I said, like a nice sexy twist to it. So I really like this scent a lot and I always get compliments when I wear this scent. And it is so good. I need to pull it back out. Actually, I had this stored away and I brought it out for this video. And now that I'm smelling it, I feel like I need to bring it out and wear it this fall because it smells really, really good. So Central Amber is coming in at number five here. So coming in at number four, I don't even know if you all remember this line that came out at Bath and Body Works. I didn't even know about it until um, one of my coworkers had mentioned it to me, but it is Sea Talks. And this is actually a body cream, you guys. Here's the packaging on that. But this body cream gets me tons of compliments. Like, and it's not even a fragrance mist, it's not even a perfume, it's a body cream. So that shows how like fragrance and potent this stuff is. So the scent notes on this is, yeah, it says sea powered moisturizing body cream, it leaves your skin feeling soft, sea, oh, sea breeze soft. It just says to revitalize your skin with nourishing ingredients and minerals from the depths of the deep blue sea um and that's all it really says about the scent notes it's cute it says like marimate approved marimate approved so that's really cute but this stuff smells really good you guys like oh it just smells like the ocean right like yeah it just smells like the ocean um open water um it's like um kind of like mineral mineral ocean if that makes sense I don't really know how to describe it but like it smells really really good and I typically pair this with the Perry Ellis 360 that's in like the purple bottle and the those two pair perfectly together and every single time I remember when I was working at the office I was working in corporate and every single time I walked into the office and I had this on the lady she would always say are you wearing the mermaid scent are you wearing the mermaid scent and I was like I am so this stuff is really good the fact that she knew what it was like and it was right when I walked in the door so I always got compliments every time I wore this scent would highly recommend it I think it's discontinued but if you can get your hands on it I would say go for it because this stuff is really really good okay so coming in at Okay, so coming in at number three is a scent I actually don't have any more. I used it up, but it is Mad About You. I absolutely love that scent. Let me see if I can get the fragrance notes on that for you. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of leave a picture of the, the item here while I talk about the scent notes. So the scent notes on it is Black Currant, Bright Peony, Pink Jasmine, White Patchouli, and Vanilla Musk. You guys, this scent smells so good. It's kind of like a blend of fruitiness and flowers, like fruity flowers. Um, but it has like, um, I don't know, like an elegance to it that makes it not like a kitty fruity scent or like a over mature floral scent. It's just like a nice, like I said, um, I don't know, elegant fruity floral so I really like that scent a lot it was my travel scent for like the longest and that's why it took me so long to use it up I had the big size bottle and I would just put it into a travel size and anytime I was uh traveling and didn't want to put use an actual perfume I would just spray that all over me and people would love it and people would give me compliments so if you all have not tried Mad About You 
definitely recommend it um i do have maybe just a shower gel left in my collection from mad about you but um if i saw the fine fragrance mist again i would definitely repurchase it because i really really enjoy it and really really like it um coming in at number two so this i used up in the fine fragrance mist as well i don't have the fragrance mist but i do have the shower gel i'm gonna leave an image of the um fine fragrance mist here on the screen but the scent notes on this is black raspberry burgundy rose bergamot incense dark vanilla bean and plum musk and i'm gonna go ahead and just smell this to get remember oh okay y'all dark kiss i'm talking if you want to be grown and sexy if you want to stand out if you want to have people if you have want to have that alluring ambiance against you i'm gonna need for y'all to get dark kiss this stuff is so so good like it lasts all like the lasting power on this is ridiculous like i would always smell it like on my clothes hours hours later after i wore it like i could put it on at the beginning of the work day it still be on at the end of the work day and people could smell it on me like they used to compliment me all the time on this scent and like i said i used to have it in the fine fragrance mist that's how i was introduced to the scent and i've since bought it in the uh, body cream and the shower gel and i think this is just like a backup shower gel that i have but if you pair all three of those together baby you're gonna be smelling good you're gonna be smelling sexy you're gonna be smelling grown so um definitely love dark kiss i would highly recommend that if you haven't checked that out give it a go and then my number one most complimented scent from bath and body works to date is none other than in the stars you guys this Perf I mean, this fine fragrance mist performs like a perfume. I'm talking, it's top notch. I absolutely love the scent. It's so, so good. Um, let me read you the scent notes on this. So the scent notes on this is starflower, sandalwood, musk, sugar, tangelo, white arcwood, and radiant amber. Okay, so I, I can get the hints of amber in here, but it's very subtle. This, I don't even know how to really describe this. It's a very unique scent and... Um, to me it just smells like i don't know it smells so good it's, it, it makes a statement when you walk into the room this is like a statement type of fragrance like i really really enjoy it a lot it's kind of like a mix between oh i don't even it's so unique but it's so so good like this scent really reminds me of cloud and a lot of people say that cloud is like a unisex scent i could see this being a unisex scent as well but i could definitely smell the amber I guess Starflower is the main scent in there because that's what I read off the scent notes. But I don't know what it is, but it just has this awesomeness to it that I really, really love and really, really enjoy. And other people love it on me. I always get tons of compliments when I wear it in the stars. Like people always ask me, what are you wearing? Oh my God, you smell so good. Like this is a top notch compliment getter. Like all the other ones, like I get compliments on too. But this, every time I step out of the house in this, like people give me compliments like I even remember like I had some guests over here at the house and as soon as I walked downstairs I had just sprayed some on they could smell it on me before I even got all the way down to the bottom of the staircase so this stuff is good and it has really great projections so if you want to be noticed if you want to stand out if you want to smell good definitely in the stars this is my number one top complimented scent from bath and body works so yeah i hope you all enjoyed this video i am going to be doing more top favorite videos from bath and body works i'm thinking about doing some candle videos um i know i got another request for my top all-time favorite scents from bath and body Works. so that's actually going to be the, the the video that i film next so stay tuned for that um and then i want to maybe do like top favorite shower gels top favorite body creams etc etc because um those things do look different because i do have different scents for those from my top five because i'm looking at different things as far as like performance is concerned in those different categories so i'm super excited to kind of start i guess like this little series where i do the top favorites from bath and body works so these are my most complimented scents from bath and body works um i do upload every tuesday thursday and saturday saturdays in particular are my bath and body work videos so definitely come by next week if you like what you saw here definitely stick around and join the happy family i would love to have you so you all tell me what is your most complimented scent from bath and body works i would love to know did any other items on my list make your list or um yeah what are the scents that you all were that people always give you compliments on definitely let me know down in the comments and yeah you guys as always leave me some love in the comments down below and i'll see you in my next video i hope you have a wonderful awesome spectacular day Bye.